Hey everybody, this is Nemo and in today's very quick tip, we will see how to easily clean up our back office modules list in PrestaShop and of course get rid of those annoying must-have and partner modules. So the first thing you should know is that the extra modules list is not fetched from PrestaShop.com every time as it's actually cached and saved into XML files. These files can be found in config, let me show you, config XML. So let's see what we have here. We're interested in default country modules list and must have modules list. So let's see what happens if I get rid of those. Refresh and let's see if the number changes here. So it's 171. Nope, still the same and you could see how long it took to fetch from prestashop.com the uh, new modules list. So what we can do is prevent the back office from loading anything from the add-on store or in any case pressashop.com. So this can be done with a very simple modification to the tools class. So let's go back here. Classes and let's find tools somewhere here. Let's look for add-ons, add-ons request and we should simply return false save now let's get rid of those so config XML actually I will prefix them okay so now let's see 171 and BAM not only that's faster but look 82 models only now I want you to notice something scrolling down here in the tools class um, we have other entities not being loaded since we return false so in case you're having any kind of other issue make sure you check this file and just in case um, use any condition against the request variable and return false in that case only then if you're still seeing unwanted modules Try renaming another couple of files, and those being the modules native add-ons and trusted modules list. But of course, um, check you're not missing anything you need after changing this. Now, in the same way, we can get rid of add themes on the theme configuration page. And the file we need to modify in this case is admin themes controller. So let's get to it first. Actually, let's verify we do have ads on the themes page. So let me refresh this and we do. So let's open up that file. So press the shop controllers, admin, and I'm gonna use a search here. Admin themes controller. Okay, so add-ons. And we need to modify Ajax process get add-ons themes and we simply kill it. So die. Alright, so let's go back and refresh this now. And you can see nothing is loaded anymore from Prestashop.com. So this will perhaps not make your Prestashop back office lightning fast, but can certainly help in some of the worst case scenarios. Alright. This is everything for today's video as always, thanks for watching and I will see you next time.